Mikey. I am going to be talking to you today about the Flux Raider Joa Gear holster. And this is kind of my first experience, first impressions with it so far. And unfortunately, I haven't been able to do a lot of shooting just with the cost of ammo on the market these days. But I've been really enjoying it. I'd say, and this is kind of just going against my own personal preference, I ride a high optic, but with a traditional lower optic on here, it conceals fairly well. Even with this, it's not the end of the world with a larger shirt on. I like it so far. I really love that it's QLS. It's got pretty good retention. I kind of have a, a, a virgin flux, if you will. There's not too much on there. And these are designed to be rocked with the, uh, the ripstick charging handles and whatnot. So it's a little loose retention on there, but provided you're not doing uh, ridiculous burpees and somersaults and pole vaults and whatnot, it should stay in pretty well. I've done a little bit of moving with it so far and it hasn't really given me any big issues. I really do love, I'm not sure how I got up there, but the QLS right there is fantastic. I rock a uh, P320 Safari Land and switching back and forth between that is just uh, easy peasy. It literally took me about three seconds to do it over by my pit and I'm already just ready to go rocking a PDW for the day versus a carbine and pistol. So I've been enjoying it so far. Also, just for all the cool guys out there, you gotta love the flex time. Yeah. So that's always a plus for me. But that's kind of my, my first impressions on it. I like it. I can't wait to use it some more and just really get a, a good grounding with it. But so far, 